today I'm here with a new video and also a new series, I think, I'm not sure. Last year I had my Zodiac series and I really like to have a series, but and one that is coming each month. But for this year I don't actually know what I want to do. I have a little like idea like the palette of the month, so where I use the palette maybe two or three times one month and do different things with it. And first I was like, okay, I'm going to do like in January, I'm going to take a palette that starts with a J. And in February, one that starts with an F and so on and so on. So I start to write down and then I came to June, July. And it was like, I have one palette that starts with a J. I at least think, I'm pretty sure. So uh, I don't know if I'm going to keep to do that the whole year because I don't have that many palettes but we will see I will at least start this with the palette of the month is just my luck from Colourpop I really like this palette but I have only used it once and I really like this year I want to use the palettes I have more and just not to buy new ones so yeah, I'm going to use this today and do whatever I want with it. And the next video this month with this palette, I'm going to do a palette bingo. So I'm thinking about doing two, two looks with the palette of the month. One look where I can decide for myself and one that is palette bingo. So if you didn't know, so the palette looks like this and I really, really love the shade in the middle. And I used it in my first impression. I can leave my first impression up here. I did a pretty grungy look. I want to do something a little grungy, but not that grungy. So yeah, I think we just get started. So okay, I think I will start with... I don't really know. We can start with this. Chances are... Just take it in my crease, but I don't know if this is like too light to have in my crease. We will see. Maybe not too light, but like a little pastel y. Maybe not. I don't know if I used this in my first impression. Okay, I have used this palette once more. I did a palette bingo with all of my monochromatic palette from Colourpop but then I only used one of these shades so I was really like I want to use this palette more because I really like it so it's just sitting on my desk and I don't know if it is because of my low buy that I want to use the things I have more or if it's just it feels like YouTube is going a little bit away from just first impressions. They are still super popular, but it feels like a lot of people want to use what they have. And so do I. I actually think this works good. I, I just had to pack it on, but it worked. I want to take this act normal. Yeah, I have a green. <laughs> I have green nails. So this act normal and just take it on my whole lid. Yes, I want to do that. And I don't think I have used this shade before. It didn't look swatched when I opened the palette, so. And it feels like my channel has like gone over to be a green channel. What happened there? I have no idea. Like I'm having a little bit of struggle with this shade. I don't know why because it's just a green shade. 
works, but it's weird, like, a little bit of struggle. Now I want to go in with my absolute favorite shade, this Mary Jane, and put it over the screen. I really hope that this will look cool. I swatched it on my hand earlier. <laughs> Then it looked cool, and I think it does. Maybe I shouldn't have taken it on the whole lid, but hey. I just don't know if this Act Natural is behaving as I want it to. I don't know why. Maybe it isn't that cool that I wanted it to be. Bench. Is this why I never do like just what I want to make up? Because then it's not looking that good. I want to go in with this Mobamba. And put it on my outer... V, kinda. This too, look. Deepen it down a little bit. And maybe dragging it in a little bit. But then I go in with the brush that I took in Mary Jane. And just put it a little over. Maybe that was better. Maybe. Or maybe not. Okay, so something like this. I actually don't know what I think because I f it feels like the green. I don't want to wear green. The one that I put on my whole lid isn't like that even but i don't know i will at least take away my fallouts fix my base and my brows i almost said maybe fill them in a little bit i will see what i will do but i will fix my base and then i'll come back so okay face is on and now it's time for the under eyes and i think i will take chances are this one and also this one and just like do the same. So I will start with the chances are. And just smudge it under my eyes. It will stick. And it really feels like I need to stop doing green. And then I just go in with Act Natural. I won't say Act Neutral all the time, but it's not called that. Just take it, like try to take it a little bit closer to my lash line. So like that, and then I think I want to go in with a green in mortar line actually. Or do I? I think I will take a teaspoon from Colourpop. And then I just will pop on some mascara, 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 scare. And for lips, I will go in with Love Life from Colourpop. It is a red one, of course. So yeah, this is my finished look with just my luck palette, my... I do a whatever I want look and I like the look maybe it didn't turn out as good as I wanted it to but I like it and it's going to if I continue with the series it's going to be fun to use the palettes I have and I actually really 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 like this palette but I like never use it so yeah this was my I do what I want look with the just my luck from Colourpop 
So yeah, and if I'm going to make this a series, I really hope that you will enjoy this series. I will see if I'm going to keep doing these. I don't know, but yeah. I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do. So you don't miss any of my videos and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!